I'm Marcel Fontenot and this is a look at headlines from the KTC newsroom for this Wednesday, April 27th. Opelousas police are working to solve a shooting that killed a four year old and another man. Police say they were called at about nine o'clock to the 700 block of Mia Drive about a fight. When they got there last night, they were told everything was OK. Police then say four hours later, another call about a shooting. Three other teenagers were also injured. Police are now searching for a suspect. Well, the Lafayette Police Department is facing a public records lawsuit over the investigation into former interim police chief Wayne Griffin. The advertiser and current are seeking documents related to a sexual harassment complaint against Griffin. Griffin was placed on administrative leave following those allegations. He was then fired in January. A district court judge is reviewing the documents and will decide if any of them will be made public. In St. Landry Parish, the Chamber of Commerce is teaming up with St. Landry Economic Development to host the first business summit. The meeting is to celebrate how hard working the community is while giving business owners information they can use to be further successful. The goal of the summit is to advance an atmosphere of learning similar to a TED Talk. We're really excited about it. We wanted to bring this program uh, to the community because we are just primed and ready for some growth and innovation here in St. Landry Parish. And turning to weather, Rob, quite the beauty out there today. What's in store to come? Well, if you like today, you're going to like tomorrow as well. It's going to be a little bit warmer tomorrow, but another cool one tonight. Temperatures dropping down into the 50s by the daybreak. We'll go about 54 for the low in Lafayette, but lower 50s northern portions of Acadiana. Then lots of sunshine tomorrow. Warm temperatures will get into the mid 80s as we cruise toward the weekend. It's going to be a little bit milder tomorrow night into Friday morning, lower 60s. Back into the mid 80s Friday, and then the wind kicks up, and that trends going to continue through the weekend as well. Near term overnight tonight, we see readings getting down to near 55 right at daybreak and then tomorrow up to about 84, some four degrees warmer than what it was on our Wednesday. And as we head into the weekend, Friday looking good, Saturday looking good, but we could see uh, some scattered showers and possibly a thunder shower Sunday anytime from mid morning through the afternoon hours. So we'll be watching for that. And next week, it looks like a little bit of a summer preview on the way. As if for news and weather for now, stay with KTC, KTC.com and social media for the very latest.